major, major headache for about 100 students chased out of their dorms by a flood at the University of Michigan, and tonight they do have to sleep somewhere else. A water pipe broke this morning and caused a lot of damage in the North Quad. 7 Action News reporter Julie Bonovich tells us about the aftermath in Ann Arbor. There were students in the building when the flooding happened. Now, there were no injuries, but a lot of students have to find somewhere else to live tonight. I was in the halls and some people just running around like, did you see what happened? Rajiv Bat's friend took this cell phone video while running toward the source of the excitement. There's water everywhere. Thousands and thousands of gallons of water flooding the dorm rooms at the University of Michigan's North Quad. And there was maybe two inches of water on the ground. The coupling ruptured in one of the pipes of the sprinkler system in a stairwell on the fourth floor. <laughs> Floors three and four suffered the most damage. It was just three inches of water on the floor. Third floor had water going on the sides of the wall and like on the top. Azad Barazi lives on the fourth floor. He is one of 100 students affected by the flood. It was awful and it smells really bad. The sophomore didn't lose much, but his roommate lost an important asset to every college student's life submerged in three inches of water. My roommate left his laptop on the floor, and if he didn't back up his information and stuff, that might all be lost. Classes that are held in the building had to be canceled because the flooding damaged some areas in that part of the building, but it was minimal. Well, I don't know where to go right now. The university says they will relocate all 100 students affected by the flood to some form of emergency housing. Students can claim damages on their parents' homeowner's insurance. The university says they're working with those students who don't have insurance on a case-by-case -case basis. From Ann Arbor, Julie Bonovich, 7 Action News.